The most interesting thing in tech, there's a paper that just came out in Science Magazine about conspiracy theories and AI. And it's pretty interesting, because we generally think of AI and generative AI as something that injects misinformation into the ecosystem. We think of algorithms driving us down rabbit holes where we start to believe conspiracy theories. So the researchers decided to test this proposition in a pretty interesting way. They asked lots of Americans, hey, do you believe in conspiracy theories? Gave them a survey. The people who said yes, well, then they put them into the next stage of the test where they had three back and forth conversations about their conspiracy theory with GPT-4. So they would say, this is what I believe about 9-11. The AI bot would summarize what you believe about 9-11. And then they would go back and forth. The person would explain, well, this is why explosive had to be planted. And the AI system would say, well, maybe actually it could have fallen because of the planes. And it was incredibly interesting. It turned out that people's beliefs in conspiracy theories dropped substantially. And not only that, it stayed that way for multiple months. And not only that, it didn't just drop on the particular conspiracy theory that they debated with the AI bot, it dropped across conspiracy theories. So why is that? Well, AI systems are pretty good at this, right? They have lots of information. They can respond very quickly. They're infinitely patient. <laughs> it, it is hard for us talking to our crazy uncle or our crazy cousin about what actually happened on 9-11. The AI bot doesn't care. And so what's important about this is A, it suggests the possibility that these systems could actually make democracy better. There is no question that there will be ways that people use and weaponize sophisticated generative AI to make democracy work worse, to make us not trust each other, to inject false information left and right. What I believe profoundly and deeply, and what I think is one of the most important things for the people who are working in AI, there are ways to architect these systems that can make the economy work better, that can create wealth that can make democracy work better, and there are ways to do the opposite. And this study gives a really interesting way of doing that. That's the most interesting thing in tech. I'll see you later.